Okay, so here's a short video of uh, how to replace rear brake pads on a vehicle that's got electronic parking brake. So it's a little bit different. You don't need a scan tool. Uh, you can do this with a, just a 12 volt battery and I'll show you how. Now, um, here's the caliper I've, and there's the motor for the electronic parking brake. Unplug the motor and so now the the motor is disconnected from the vehicle and you run two wires, there's two pins inside that connector, you run the two wires to a battery, I've just got a 12 volt battery here and uh, there's only two ways to hook it up either the correct way or the incorrect way and so here's how you're gonna find out if you've got it set up correctly or not you're gonna energize the motor and at the same time you're gonna look at the piston if the piston starts coming out then you need to stop and reverse the wires. If you energize the motor and the piston doesn't move at all, then you know you've got it set up correctly and you just leave it energized until that piston starts to rotate. Then you stop and then you're good to just push it in like a regular old front caliper. So I've got this thing hooked up incorrectly and watch this piston while I energize it. See it was coming out, so I stop. And I know that's wrong. So then I'm gonna change my battery polarity and I'm gonna energize it again. And so now I see nothing's happening and I just keep this motor going until this thing starts to rotate. done. All right, now I can just take a regular piston tool and push that piston all the way back in and put your new brake pads on. So there you have it. You don't need a scan tool and anybody can do it. So there you go. Thanks for watching.